this field as princes. And we had a police action. <laughs> we decided then that if we were to meet, we would have a war. And a war we shall have. Bring forth the war arrow. during the police action. We said there would be a war. And when I won my crown tournament, in remembrance of that, I snapped this arrow into three parts. But this arrow is too fine to waste this day. So I would use it upon the archery field to earn my points.
I'm Jack. King of Meridiers. And on this day, we declare, we pledge our friendship to all and our swords to the middle. And as for the the might of their people and the blades of their army. Our words are not hollow, for Kalantir is like a mighty lion. We provide only the roar. We shall pledge our swords and cast our lot with the mid-realm in war, and we shall offer our hospitality, our friendship, and our mercy to all. Come on! I say this for my king, Artan IV, and our fair queen, Aziza. We will stand with our brothers Kalantir and fight for our good hosts and cousins, Finn and Garlanda, and the Middle Kingdom.
Kingdom of the East.
Yeah, I, I had to sit out one. Come on, Uber, get in there! That's a great price. <laughs>
What if she's just gonna fall down? <laughs> Look at you. Thank <laughs> you. 
fighting so. No. <laughs> All the way down, and when he hit the ground, he stayed down, and his helmet was broken and came off. And we went, and my man, immediate reaction was, <laughs> and, and a moment later, I mean, not immediately, the guy was, I think the guy was actually out momentarily. He got up and said, I'm okay. But I still said, <laughs>
He comes over and declares it to me. Daddy, you're dead. You're dead. Not really dead. Give me the banner in the head. You know what about the rest of Uh, Please don't hold it right there. Thank you. Are we doing this for fun? You know what? We've got a couple of other good Comars to that Amaranth next to him. What kind of weapon? Become a Kalukia. Talk to Daddy, too. Tell him, too. No. What's this? Red Row! 
Okay, they're, they're, offering, single they're offering single combat. This isn't good. Here's a who they're offering single combat again. Tomar. Uh, so Tomar. Tomar. Tomar single combat. Tomar! Tomar! Who just who died in single combat right there? Tomar! 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 <laughs> yeah, he's better at it. Come on, go more! Yeah, the, the plan of going through all the one by one is now. Hey, what about that leg, huh? Look at that guy with the weight
that from within the race, rising to positions of great honor. A warrior has many virtues, such as skill at arms, leadership on the field, and teaching of the arts of martial. Therefore, we, Senator Garbanza, King and Queen of the Midrealm, do here and recognize the as premier members of the Order of the Red Cross, they styled themselves the sergeants of this noble order, and bearing that, as duly registered with the College of Arms, intended upon this year, found on Thursday, the 18th day of August, on a very important 28th, for our undoubted champions, our annual foe for the field, the battle of the 23rd century war, and with this we do here set our hands and seal, Finn, Rex, Garbanza, Ragina.
pleasure while sitting the dragon throne to create eight knights. In that same period of time, I have awarded only twice our Order of the Dragon's Tooth. Many of our knights prize this award equal to their belts and chains. On this day, inviting us and our populace to your court. And on behalf of the Eastern Kingdom, for the honor that has been shown to us by Finn and Garlanda of the Middle, Vivas! 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 Yeah. <laughs> 
Another cartoon. Well, one gentle man. It's as cool. He's all. William of Fairhaven. <laughs> be invited to join our most noble order. We. Uh, yeah. Their Majesties call forth William of Fairhaven. Right. So that you have shown the greater qualities of prowess at arms, honor, nobility and most certainly leadership on the field that betoken a member of my most beloved order of the chivalry. Therefore, we charge you to stand your vigil, think well on your deeds and heart, and present yourselves to our court this evening while you will be offered elevation into the order of the chivalry.
cavalry. What say you? He who must be kingdom, some of the most chivalrous and honorable fighters of the realm. Not once did I hear a complaint from our enemies on our acceptance of blows, our courtesy and chivalry on the field, and our gracious and humble defeat. But there are more battles to come. <laughs> I think that we can definitely say, say that we won the style point. <laughs> oh! My order of chivalry and my unbelted champions. There's one with whom I was very impressed this day. 
Lynn Ravensfoe, come before your king. Lord Rin, you were the last of our champions upon the field this day, and you fought and you were defeated with honor. Unfortunately, I've given away my only dragon's tooth, <laughs> but if you stop by my camp later, I will give you yours. <laughs> Oh, that's the Black Star of Anstiora. That's them. Are they with us? No, they're with the other side. Always. Always. That was so They laughed at us when we brought uh, them to suggest that they might fight with us. Oh, well, they're going to film on the other side of the hill. I don't think I'm going to film that one. They're working on the place for us. It was, it was a decent tactic. It was a decent tactic. We are just, in the open, you have to understand with the tactics that we use, we can inflict massive ca Congratulations. I can't believe you did this. Jeez. It's pretty. It should still be in tune. Tell them it's just a loner. We didn't. <laughs> <laughs> that's cold. Oh, that's cold. Do you guys call Keith? No. Is he doing today? Friday. Tomorrow? I don't know what to say. Yes, dear. <laughs> 